Hi, welcome back to the Step Into Life Kitchen. Today we are joined by Jackie, who is the owner of two Step Into Life franchises, Doncaster and Temple Stowe. Thank you very much. Thank you. So today's focus is all about quick and healthy lunches. We are all in a hurry these days, so the quicker and the more convenient the better, but it's all about health as well. Yes. So we are going to today make jar noodles. Now, it does seem like a bit of a odd concept, but um, it's really simple and the packaging is really, really easy. So you can get quite creative with the variations. So today, Jackie is going to help me. Um, we're using um, rice noodles, but like I said before, you could actually substitute the rice noodles for either um, sweet potato noodles or um, zucchini noodles. And I just made those with um, a spiruli, but I guess you could grate them. Probably grate them, yes. Yeah, and make some um, kind of kid friendly as well yes. too. So um, they are the options. So. Um, if you, I will just pop these in here. Um, now, Jackie, if you could start to pass me the um, parsley. So parsley? this is parsley and um, chives, but you could do whatever herbs you like, coriander, mint. It's not really a hard and fast rule. It's to taste, it's what you prefer. Um, oh, and so you really do need to try and shove everything down into the jar. Um, again, it's to taste. Um, if you could pass me the snow peas. Now, sure. um, I actually do like snow peas and I actually will eat them raw. Some people don't even like them cooked at all. So again, this is to my taste. Um, again, everything just goes into the bottom of the jar. Jackie, can you guess what the purple thing is? <gasps> is that beetroot? No. Oh. Funny, that. These are purple carrots. Now you can do this with normal carrots, mm -hmm. but um, I wanted to That's get- That's good color. Yes. I wanted Colour, to get, more vibrancy. Yes, I wanted to get creative again. They are carrots shredded. Um, you can use normal carrots. You don't have to use purple carrots, but they're everywhere at the moment. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Would your kids eat purple carrots? Oh, if I could disguise it well, probably. <laughs> <laughs> again, so um, it's to taste. Now, we did discuss, we do think the water may actually go um, purple. Or go pink, um, yellow, purple. Yeah, but that's pretty cool at the desk. Now, again, um, for taste, if you could just pass me one of the lemon wedges. Um, again, um, you could actually just um, leave the lemon out if you are gonna be doing this at work and there's a lot. But the secret ingredient is the miso satchel. So um, again, all of these ingredients can be found at your local supermarket. Mm -hmm. You can find any miso paste satchel that you like in the Asian section. If you can't find any miso soup, we're also thinking just basic stock. Yes. Um, just the powdered mm -hmm. stock, um, a teaspoon of that would be fine. So again, make it to taste, get creative. Um, and if you don't like something or you know, um, cause this would actually work, I was thinking for older mm. kids, maybe not for the, the little ones, but the older kids might like this one. So if you could pass me the boiled water. So this is probably um, the only bit that you'll need to get up out of your desk for. So um, I reckon maybe one to two um, cups of boiling water. Again, it just depends on how big your um, jar is. Lid on. Now for safety reasons, stand away from the desk. <laughs> <laughs> Watch out, that doesn't happen, but give it a shake. Now, you may need to leave this, um, oh, I would reckon maybe five minutes. Yeah. So think of this as your, your healthy two-minute noodles. So leave it for five minutes, let it, um, at least let the noodles cook, and then if you think you need to add more hot water, you can come back and add hot water. And we will leave that there for a moment. So you do need to wait uh, five minutes just for the noodles to cook. We did um, add another cup of water and you do need to give it a stir, but just for safety reasons, just be really careful of the steam when you take the lid off. And the trick is always open it away from you. So if there is any steam, it's not going to go near you. 
give it a bit of a stir. Oh, that smells really lovely, actually. Does it smell good? Now, yes. Now, what were you saying Ooh. about miso? Miso soup is actually a good fat burner. So um, I'm not actually quite sure what's in it, but I've heard that it's a very good fat burner, good for weight loss. Um, a awesome. lot of people, when you're on diets, they say try and in between meals uh, drink some miso soup, which is very good for you. And you were also saying that the liquid counts towards your... Well, you've put three cups of water in there. So yep. if we're, most people are eating, drinking on average eight cups of water a day, there's your three in your meal. So that's easy. This is healthy, quick, convenient. As I said, give it a bit of a stir, waiting for the noodles to um, cook down. And that is... A right. healthy lunch. Smells good and colourful. It does. Colorful. Good. It does. <laughs> it's all about vibrancy. It does. It's great. Thank you.